it used to be a Form 19A, and Revenue have actually produced a completely separate form that you can donate your tax relief to. Now, this is the most amazing thing in real terms, because for a long time, I thought this was higher rate taxpayers relief. And uh, you look at it and you say, okay, as a basic rate taxpayer, you're paying, as I said, 28%, and as a higher rate taxpayer, you're paying 22%, blah, blah. But it's more than that, because the words are, would you like to give your tax repayment, not your gift aid repayments or your gift aid tax <coughs> It's your tax repayments to charity. And if we have a look at that form, being slightly bigger, this is the important thing. Okay? Now, what they didn't say in the budget, and what they're also not sure about, and I've got a calculation here, and I'm very nervous about showing it to you because I hope it's right. So if anybody does find a mistake in it, please come back to me because I can't get an absolute ruling from revenue on this. But what this does is the most amazingly powerful thing that you as fundraisers should be doing. <coughs> because it effectively says you can donate the tax relief that you get through your self-assessment to charity. But what it doesn't do is allow you to donate to more than one charity. So if I can use another sort of basic type of example. It's a little bit like getting pregnant. Only one can get there. There are a lot in the race, but only one can get there. So only one number can go in that block. So if, and just as another question, how many of you know whether you are registered for self-assessment giving as a charity? You do know that you're registered. Because it's another one of those that revenue don't make too much of a song and dance about you. A lot of charities believe that because they're registered for gift aid, they're registered for self-assessment giving, and they're not. Revenue and their wisdom make it a completely different number, <coughs> and you have to go and register for that, and they don't even tell you how to do it. So it's a question of, excuse me, how do I do this? And they say, well, send us a letter telling us who you are, and then we'll send you another letter. You know, it's not a simple thing to do. You can download form from their website, and there's a form called Essay Donate. For the charities? Thanks, because last time I looked, and I obviously haven't looked for a while. Yes, I don't know. Yes, I don't know. Thank you very much for that, because last time I looked, it wasn't there, and I appreciate that I haven't seen it. 